Hey, so hi, hello. Um, today is another MLB The Show 21 uh, video. I'm still getting used to saying that. But anyways, today, as you can tell by the, um, the title, we are playing Road to the Show. Apparently, there's a new narrative, like, thing or something. Oh, have you been talking? I just want, there's one team I've heard, what? Not really, but I... Uh, I don't know. What is, what is this? What is this? No. Favorite your pin... No. Favorite you're pinning your hopes on? No, sir. It's probably the best. Not yours to decide anyway. Right. I don't want to tie up your line. Good luck, son. Okay, continue. What is it? Is Carlos, that a you 12? That is that a what in the... Career. What's this world like? Oh, it's extremely exciting. You whoa, whoa, whoa. I can't hear this. You will get the call. We've I'm got checking. a developing story here. JP, what are you hearing? I'm checking the numbers. I'm hey. talking to my source and my scouts. And they're all telling me, hey, this could actually work. Most whoa, of whoa, us whoa, 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 whoa. that age, we were barely chewing gum and walking at the same time, let alone playing the hardest game. I don't know if he, this is loud for you. What is happening? Dream again, the big leagues is now becoming reality with that. What is this? Call. Give me that phone call. Are you kidding me? The Royals. The Royals. Continuing our MLB really? draft day two right, wrap up right. coverage. Back I'm trying to, to the listen. prospect that we mentioned before the break. There was some surprise, even some criticism of the front office over how early he went off the board. Jonathan Mayo, what do you think of this pick? Man, I, I don't think any of us saw this one coming. This uh, definitely feels like a, a reach to me. Uh, you know, I, I had they call me a reach? What is guy. this? Uh, there was a split camp. A lot of scouts disagreed whether he's better as a pitcher or better as a hitter. Oh, uh, not I'm this. The, the, the team yeah, so apparently you can go like switch. He's got potential on both sides of the ball, and, and maybe that adds some value to him. But uh, this made me scratch my head <laughs> a little bit for sure. All right, Jonathan Mayo, thanks. Uh, what about you, Jim mm -hmm. Callis? Was this a head scratcher or the reach of the draft, as some of the other analysts have suggested? Yeah, you know, I, I talked to somebody with the team, and they look, they're they are excited to get this guy. This is a guy they really want. And the two points. All right, the so the Royals me, really want me. One, you know, this whole debate, is he a hitter, is he a pitcher? You know, what are you going to do with him? You know, there was a lot of confusion. This team isn't confused. This team feels like he's a, he's got very good potential as a hitter and as a pitcher. They may even try to play him both ways. And they also, they felt like there were a couple other teams mm -hmm. that were starting to sniff around this guy. And, you know, this isn't the NFL or NBA draft where you can trade down to get a guy you want. If you want a guy, you have to take him because there, there's no trades. And, and they felt like if they didn't take him where they did, somebody else was going to get them. And they just absolutely I did not want that to happen. I have a feeling Jim Callis, these we guys don't like Thanks. me. <laughs> so, on the path to greatness, okay. Naturals? Natures, the club is intrigued by your potential as a two-way player. End game, let's try it. Um, in the outfield, definitely. Right. Well, you give you a one game on the mound and a couple in the field, and then we'll touch base again. Okay. Rolling along with the podcast and back mm -hmm. on the prospect who's divided the scouting community. I am opposed to this belief that he went too high. I really think he could be a steal here. This is a guy who's got so much development left to do. He's got so much potential. And I think all the scouts who are down on him think, oh, he's not a finished product. We don't know what he is. That, to me, could be a good thing. He can hit. He can field. He can pitch. There is so much untapped potential so far for this guy. I'm excited to see what he becomes. And certainly as he gets started actually playing, actually being in games, we're going to be able to talk to some other folks who get a better read on him and see what they think. I'm excited for that. And frankly, I'm going to have my eye on him for a while. All right. I remember in the ball player, the ball player thing, it talked about that guy. 
and also the MLB network, guys. Uh, play next. Did it just make me simulate a week? Um, is it a fastball change up curve? No. No, coach. Let's have a look at them. Your three top options. I don't want them to be normal. What would you like to do? Um, I want to replace my change up. As you progress through your career, various facilities will become available. Bad and cage bullpen, a training facility, and a practice field. Each facility will offer you the ability to increase your attributes even more through special training mini games. Oh, not those mini games again. There are plenty of ways to increase the physical game of your player. Make sure to yeah yeah yeah. So circle change, screwball curves, you can curve enough curve, slider, splitter, some curve on the fastball. Uh, you, there's literally every pitch here. Um, okay, uh, why not a palm ball? Okay, you added a palm ball to your pitching repertoire. Um, I'm fine with that. Bullpen. Four seam control and walk for nine. All right, I'll do that. Okay, now what do I do? Play next appearance. Are you gonna? Okay, so am I pitching? Am I playing the outfield? Sick your load out. So I guess I'm playing the out. This really don't make sense. I'll get used to it. Uh, let's make this road of the show a better one than last year. I mean, if you watched the, if you watched it, then you know. All right. The travelers. You tell me they're hitting me fifth. What is this? Uh, this guy has normal pitches, nothing different, uh, throws it slow. Wait, do they have showtime? I'm pretty sure you can unlock showtime, but I don't think you get it right away. <sighs> Wait, come on. Let's go... Ball. Oh, you're gonna hit me, huh? Really? Oh, jeez. I, I don't know if you know this, but I'm not good at base running. I just saved myself, dude. I, I just saved myself. If I didn't steal here, there, that's a double play. Bubba Starling. Isn't this Bubba Starling guy, like, 70? I'm not gonna steal third. I don't know my... Like, they didn't make you pick, like, anomaly or... Like that. It's, like, pure power or anything like that. I remember last year it made you do that stuff. Uh, do you want me to go home? Alright, you want me to stay? Alright. I thought that was getting through. Alright. Wait, I wanna see. Can I see my player card? Oh, I guess not. I guess I can do that after. Get through. Oh, come on. Don't you dare let him jeter me. I guess I'm a slow boy, huh? I guess I'm a slow boy. <laughs> Bruh. I don't know. I don't. I, I, I played with that new um, Prince Fielder card in BR. 
and I don't want to be as slow as him. <laughs> I mean, don't get me wrong, he has power. I want to be as power as him or whatever. Oh my god. And just saying I will be playing this off camera, but I'm mainly going to focus on Diamond Dynasty this year. I did a long road to the show last year. But, who knows? Oh, thank you. Thank you. I will take second. You know what? I'm going to try and steal third. Actually, no, I'm not. I'm slow. And that is the end of that inning. Yeah, yeah. Am I going to get another at bat? Yes, sir. Oh, never mind. Alright, where is this ball? I really don't get the new fly ball thing, like the blue line. It's so stupid. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I haven't done that in so long. You do not know. Alright. We're losing. I really need to, like, hit a homer, so I'm going to pull that full power swing. Go. Go. Oh, come on. I almost just tied the game off. Oh. Oh. Uh, yeah, we lost. Play next game. Pyramid bands. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, default. Advance. I still don't get this loadout. Like, it was really confusing to me. Watching those feature- Like, some of the feature premieres I got. Some of them, I just couldn't... Get my finger on them. <laughs> uh. Alright. Darren McGon. Let's see. Oh, dare it. Am I hitting... I'm hitting third? I go 0 for 3, and then they hit me third. Oh. Come on. Get out. Let's go. Thank you. That helps. Wasn't that far, but that's my first homer. <sighs> Oh, jeez. Ah. Alright. Just get on base. Just get on base. Just get on base. I don't need a homer. Just get on base. Or strike out. I'm not going to strike out. I refuse to strike out. Come on. Go ahead and get on base. I have 40 power, really? Oh. I mean, I didn't strike out. Alright, one second. I'm going to sip some water. Alright. Eric Villa. And... Uh, let's throw to third, I guess. I will say, though, these graphics look really good. Oh, no, not Dom. I remember Dom T. Williams. He was, like, a troll to me. Because I was trying to complete the Mariners collection. Right? But, this Dom T. Williams guy, the bronze... The bronze <laughs> costed, like, 5,000 stubs. And I'm just like, bro, I don't have that many stubs. He's the last guy I needed, and I didn't have enough stubs for a bronze. I had 2,000 stubs. I didn't have enough for a bronze. That Dom T. Williams. Go, 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 go. <laughs> I had the dive. 
But dude, I swear, if Dom T. Williams gets a hit off of me, I'm going to kill him. Alright, thank you. Alright. And now it's the ninth. And now we have a huge PCI. And I just can't do it. Come on, drop. Oh, are you kidding me? I've hit like three bombs, but they've all been caught. And then I hit that other one. And Alright. Well, actually, uh, well, we will look at it. We're, qu we're quickly going to look at our stats, and then I'll end the video. Anyways, if you guys would... Ooh, I got a perk. Um, wait, my profile, what? We hear all the time oh, from people oh, oh, around never the mind. game that double A is where you start to see the breaking balls that are really set apart from what you've seen before. That can be a big challenge for a young hitter. Absolutely, and I think, you know, when you, when you think back to, um, you know, some of the pitchers that I face, some of the guys that you face in the big leagues uh, for five, six, you know, ten years, you're thinking, man, I saw him somewhere. Yeah, it was double-A, because when you <laughs> see most prospects of any organization, they pretty much go to double-A just to get themselves over that hump and get ready for the league. You had a breakout season at the double-A level yourself. What was it about you that enabled you to have that kind of campaign? I, I was very confident, and I, I thought, you know, if the confidence could just stay with me consistently, which is very hard to do at any level of baseball because it's a, it's a game of failure, uh, I just try to be consistent every night, whether it was, you know, uh, defensively, offensively, um, you know, just bring something to the table. Go home with something where you felt good, and I didn't have to think about that game uh, when I went to sleep. I think that's it. Oh, oh my god. Felipe. He devoted us into the cages. Open on off days. Still good to know on your off days. You want to every bit extra time you commit to developing your bat skills will make a difference. Give it a try, okay? Um, alright. So, let's look at my player. Stats in order. Actually, no. Wait, 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 wait. The servers have been glitchy for me, like, all day. Player card. Yeah. We're not good. Alright, anyways. Um. <sighs> we're gonna end the video there. I will be playing this. If something special happens, I'll record it. But I gotta go at my lunch. I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.